everyone, how's it going? And welcome back to the channel. I hope all of you are doing amazing right now. In this video, we are going to check out all of the Season 4 Lucky Draws coming to the game in Season 4. So it should be a very exciting video. Now first here, yeah, I do want to ask if you are new around here, please do consider smacking that sub button and joining the family. And also if you do enjoy the video, a like does help out a lot. But anyways, I also want to give a huge shout out to Doge Beanie for all the leaks I'm going to show off in this video. You guys can find his channel link down below in the description. But anyways, let's hop right into the video. So over here is our first draw. And I do want to say, as you guys can see, most of the names are not in English. But at least we can see all of the skins that are going to be in these draws. So first, we have a brand new QQ9 legendary skin. And I've got to say, I'm a big fan of this gun. That turquoise on here looks absolutely stunning. And the kill effect of this gun is dope. It's like these massive jaws smashing the enemy in this dope blue effect. The soldier is going to be Vagir Mordur, I think is how you say it, and she is covered in like this fur. I've never seen her before, but she also looks very, very cool. We're also going to have an ICR1 skin, plus a brand new Renetti skin, which doesn't look too bad. And the backpack over here, guys, is just sick. I'm a big fan of this backpack, very unique, not bad at all. Then we have the shovel, and it has a bit of blue designing on the actual shovel, with this weird symbol as well, not bad. Over here is the E. Emote. Okay, he's got both axes. Yeah, he is wild. And we can also see that wolf as he does that cool little tricks over there. Not bad. We have the wild and vicious calling card of Agir Mordir on there. Okay, we have this wolf charm, this white wolf charm, not bad. And we also have an antelope A20 skin with that blue designing on there yet again. So, okay guys, that's going to be the first draw. Let me know what you guys think about that. Do you like it or not? I'm not going to lie. I think that QQ9 is absolutely stunning. Then we have the Kane 44 Dance of Death. And this thing is crazy to say the least. Firstly, it's like designed and decorated in gold. A lot of sharp edges on this actual gun it has a freaking bayonet on the front of the gun but the coolest part in my opinion is the actual mag it's like an old design like an old type of syringe as the actual mag and that is very very unique in my opinion what do you guys think of that but now over here is our new soldier being crash rigor mortis another one of these witch doctor sort of characters and this one by far so far in my opinion is the most detailed witch doctor sort of skin in the game he has like all these scapels and knives on his actual chest pouch he's got like skulls on his i would say trousers he also has that gold trimming the red eyes overall a very spooky looking soldier but very cool to say the least then we have the sick parachute like the eyes and the overall witch doctor mask we have the syringe weapon charm not bad at all over here is our emote he's got the skull Oh, takes a syringe. Okay, the purple comes out the blood. I mean, out the eyes. Uh, purple blood and red blood. Very, very unique and interesting, guys. Then we have this sick deadly Bowie knife, I believe it is. The animation on here, that red on the actual blade is sick. Also, the gold trimming on the handle. Very, very, very awesome looking knife skin. What do you guys think about that? Over here is going to be our evil medicine calling card. Okay, over here we do have a 50GS skin, decorated in gold, nothing too crazy. Over here we do have an SKS skin, again, same thing, not bad. And over here is our wingsuit to match. So what do you guys think about that draw? Do you like it or not? I think the Kane 44 is very unique. I love the soldier skin, and that knife in there is definitely one of my favorite items in that actual draw. Then we have the legendary Razorback Boreal Aegis from the Chinese version of the game. A very, very nice looking legendary Razorback skin. And it is actually reactive. It goes pink, then green. And then it has like this yellowish fiery orange, which actually also looks very, very cool. Not a bad skin whatsoever. And like I said, guys, this was first actually in the Chinese version. And now it's brought over to the global version as well. So pretty, pretty cool stuff. Now we got 
guys over here is our new soldier skin actually being a reskin of archery and she's basically designed in the same colors of the actual gun she has a light green she got the pinkish purple and she also has some black accents on the actual skin not bad actually pretty cool but it is still just a reskin over here we do have a parachute skin in these pastel colors over here is our weapon charm being swim fins and an oxygen tank okay over here we have an arctic 50 skin we have this turquoise and this pinkish colors on there same thing over here for the actual combat axe okay over here we have the alone on top calling card and then we have the mw11 in those same colors yet again as well as the backpack in those same colors again and then finally guys we also have a wingsuit to match the actual parachute so okay guys that's gonna be the third draw and now on to the fourth then we have the legendary mk2 the brand new marksman rifle coming in season four and i'm not gonna lie so far this is my least favorite legendary it's animated in green which is pretty nice it also has like these shooting stars or these bolts flying around the gun and then it does travel over the actual barrel of the gun it's not bad i'm just personally not the biggest fan of this particular skin but like i said guys not a bad skin whatsoever now over here guys we do have the soldier and that is rosa a brand new female operator coming to the game in season four and i believe this might be her first appearance in call of duty not too sure let me know down below but still a very very cool skin moving on we have an epic asm 10 animated in these green triangles not bad over here is our actual emote okay puts his feet over here on this cut down tree drinking some coffee not the most exciting emote but still it's a pretty nice one if you don't have many emotes it's not a bad one at all also kind of a long emote as well so yeah then we have a trip mine skin again animated in green same thing over here again for the karumbit karumbit skin is always nice though and this one as well looks cool the gold around the actual green over here we have the speed and style nice and then we have that motorcycle over here for real in the lucky draw as well over here we have like this metal for the actual weapon charm and then we have this military sort of green backpack as well in the actual lucky draw and also guys there is actually going to be a weapon set in this draw over here we can see what we're going to get we're going to get this uh, frame over here not bad but then over here guys is the mythic draw check out the brand new holger draw 26 we have these bats flying in this is pretty much insane check out the holger 26 this i think is the first time where a mythic really really looks very different compared to an actual legendary gun and yeah this looks like something you would use to end the world very insane looking like it a lot very bulky also a lot of moving parts on the actual gun even the barrel moves kill effect over there not bad over here like an smg version of it pretty cute still a lot of moving parts over here we also have the weapon charm uh, i don't care too much about those when it comes to mythic guns over here we have another kill effect oh okay black smoke this time out the limbs over here we have like a sniper version of the holger i don't know i'm actually just very impressed with the holger mythic skin very awesome over here with like a frame for your calling card okay that's pretty interesting otherwise very very cool skin not gonna lie over here we have kruger black hat like a goth outlaw version of kruger i'm gonna be honest out of all the cowboy skins we have in the game that one over there is my personal favorite awesome awesome looking skin guys over here we have the spr 208 again just for an epic skin that is not bad at all looking very very cool even this legendary trip mine skin a legendary trip mine that's insane but that actually just looks insane as well not bad over here we have the parachute okay it's a parachute skin a sickle okay that's sick and deadly not gonna lie big big fan of that over here we have an epic truck skin designed in black and a little bit of white designing as well not bad i would say over here also we have the dark country calling card we can see the cowboy kruger on there over here is our emote he's got the guns just firing them in the sky blows out the smoke tosses them up and oh into the holsters nice nice stuff and to finish it off we have this unique and interesting weapon charm so not a bad draw whatsoever like i said to be honest this is the first mythic which really really impresses me and sets itself quite far apart from like a normal legendary and i'm a big fan of that even the chrome design 
designing on the actual gun looks really, really good. So anyways, on to our final draw. And here we have the return of the NA45 like and throw back into the game, as well as Ruined Bone Warrior also returning back into the game. We're going to have the Out of the Fire calling card, as well as a gas grenade over here in the skin, plus the M4 Wicked Whisper as well. Over here, guys, we're also going to have this Battle Pass backpack we saw quite a while ago, reskinned and looking very cool. The RPG rounds in there. Very cool backpack. We also have a bat skin in here. Not bad. Over here is our emote. He does some pretty cool tricks over here with his knife. Flicks them around. Nothing too hectic. Throws it around. Some more tricks over there. Over here is our actual weapon charm. We got the skull on a medal. And to finish it off, guys, we have an SMRS skin as well. So, okay, guys, that is going to be all of the lucky draws coming to the game in Season 4. What do you guys think about those? For the most part, a lot of them are very, very cool. And I do like most of the skins in them. Some of them are not as cool. Like, I'm not the biggest fan of the MK2 draw. And also, not the biggest fan of the actual Redux draw featuring the NA45. Otherwise, some pretty cool stuff. So, anyway, guys, let me know you guys think down below but for now that's gonna be all from me have a great day and squally i'll catch you next one and cheers bye